Dennis Ochan is an entrepreneur who runs a timber company along Alokolum Road in Gulu municipality. He says his business has grown tremendously over the past few years, partly because of the good road network. This road has made us, our business improve in a way that nowadays the road is okay and many buyers can come. Last year, the World Bank gave Gulu Municipality a 27 billion shilling grant for constructing 15 roads under the Uganda Support to Municipal Infrastructure Development Program. Municipalities get, get assessed in terms of their overall performance and they get a performance score. So every municipality gets part of the funding as an entitlement. So the entitlement is basically a, a as a function of their population, as of their poverty headcount. We've talked about the capacities that we are <coughs> dealing with, capacities of uh, the minister. The quality was hailed for using the money for its intended purpose. Local leaders believe the new road will help the town get elevated to a city status. But other amenities like schools and hospitals are still in poor shape. A senior World Bank official, Same Waba, commended the municipality for a job well done. The land minister, Daudi Migereko, was the chief guest at the event. He urged the leaders to focus on development rather than agitate for city status. Some of the 14 municipalities that acquired World Bank grants include Gulu, Lira, Arua, Soroti, Masaka, Mbarara, and Jinja.